up guys got the Creighton 8s back out here the uh, one-fifth scale monster um, I'm gonna do a quick uh, a speed run first um, just to kind of show you what this thing is uh, geared up I do have a 23 tooth pinion in it now um, I did go to a 2.5 million weight in the center diff um, uh, stock is 1 million uh, just to try to get a little bit better air control and uh, you know balance out the power a little bit but real quick on the pinion the uh, stock Arma pinions are, are made a little bit different they're a lot thicker wider to uh because it has a wider spur gear so i used a uh, robinson racing 23 tooth and in order to fit this on here right i just used a couple of small bearings with a five millimeter hole to uh make us to make spacers to uh, meet the end clip right here there's a little clip on the end of the motor shaft which uh which is a nice safety feature armor put in there to uh help uh keep the pinion from sliding off so um i'm gonna give that a try and also i'm gonna punch five on the esc and I did bump up the motor timing uh, to, to 11.25 uh, degrees, so we're going to uh, try that out. Um, I'll just have to keep an eye on heat. Uh, max is uh, 15 degrees, but I, I don't want to go that far, you know, just out of the gate, because um, it's set to zero at stock. So we're just going to see exactly how much we can push out of this truck, and uh, we'll see how it goes. All right, guys, got the GPS cleared out. Record. Make sure it's picking up. Let's see what this big girl will do. Fifty-two. That's a little bit better than a box stock number of about 39. She's definitely up and moving now. If you guys can see that. Yeah, these things are usually a mile an hour or two slow, so uh, you know that's that's definitely low to mid 50s, give or take. So that's definitely doable for a big, uh, you know, 24 pound truck. Much better. She flies pretty nice, very balanced. <laughs> that was a bit rough. Try to get that backflip in, but just didn't have enough wheel spin. Whoo! I think that disconnected the batteries. Oh yeah. That was a hard hit because this thing weighs a ton. Fortunately, uh, she still looks straight. Chassis looks straight and the brace still looks straight. That was a bit rough. Oh, not a good spot to land.
she pulled a wheelie. <laughs> Pretty good jump for a 24-pound uh, truck. <laughs> Woo, she made the backflip. Cause I'm really impressed how good this thing's jumping for us for such a huge truck. This thing's just bulldozing off through all kinds of rocks. LVC. <laughs> All right, guys, this is after the run. I'm in the studio now. Uh, my uh, GoPro battery, I tanked on me on a bash field. Uh, but for one, this thing is a complete animal geared up. Uh, she was definitely able to get up to some good speed and, uh, you know, uh, get some good uh, ramp hits and even pull off some backflips. So uh, definitely uh, doing some diff tuning, uh, gearing it up. Again, it's got 23 tooth in it. Um, and I did, like I said, change the motor timing. That's not something I would recommend doing. Uh, I just wanted to try it out. It did seem like it helped a little bit. Uh, but it's not a huge difference uh, from what I saw. Um, you know, I may, uh, may try going up to 15 degrees and just see what that does. But I still didn't have any heat issues, uh, even running it, you know, as hard as I was out there. Um, but I did have one issue. Uh, I did have a huge stack into that rock uh, pile where she uh, just came to a complete halt. I mean, going full speed. Um, I did kind of bend the uh, tower to tower a little bit and it uh, kicked up. I mean, I didn't better see it, but it did kick up this rear chassis just a little bit in the back. You know, which is not bad, you know, saying this thing was going full bore into it. Um, and, and it was still completely drivable because I didn't even realize it happened until after the bash. So I'm not I'm not going to complain at all. Uh, you know, there is a feature of a M2C with this truck. I'll just go ahead and I'll give a heads up. Uh, that's something that we're all excited about. Uh, we're talking uh, chassis, braces, you know, all the, all, all the goodies. So that's definitely going to be something, you know, where you can um, do some fearless sending on it. So, <laughs> but, um. You know, again, I'm just uh, just just uh, uh, very impressed by this truck, uh, how it handles and how it flies. Uh, you know, I mean, there's a lot of people that you know, say this is the X Max killer, but I don't I don't really see it that way. This is a complete different platform, a whole different truck. Um, you know, it's a Fiscal Truggy. It, it I mean, it's it's very stable, very stable in the turns and just and stays planted, and this stuff flat rips it up and you know it flies like a bird. You know, you know, very balanced. So, all right, guys, until next time, RCD Data One, peace out.